Hello everybody, this is Mass King JC here, and this is a little segment I thought I would start doing from now on because I don't know, I think I'm just bored recently nowadays and I want to do something a little interesting to mix things up a bit. So yeah, uh, this is a new segment called Silly Mind Numbing YouTube Comments. By the title, you can already tell what the whole thing is already about. Now, every so often, I'll be making a video talking about certain YouTube comments that I think are silly, mind-numbing, and, you know, overall, fucking ridiculous. In today's video, I'll be talking about the Bleach fanboys. Now, as long as I've been on YouTube, I've seen many comments from Bleach fanboys. And some of them weren't really that bad, you know, some of them were, you know, decent, you know. But, recently, I, I won't say recently, I, I would just say, you know, over the years I've seen some comments that make me want to take my head and bash it in between a table. I've seen comments that make me want to take my fist and punch a hole through my computer screen. But I wouldn't do that because this computer costs like, what, thousands of dollars? So, nah. And, you know, to keep certain people anonymous, you know, a little anonymity within the community, I will be blocking out the names because I don't want people to be accusing me of sending people going out and trolling these users. But I'm going to keep their names a secret. But if you really, really want to know who these people are, then feel free to PM me. So, yeah, so the whole objective of this whole thing is for us to look at these ridiculous comments and to have a little laugh while reading them and maybe get some insight into the whole mindset of a normal Bleach fanboy. So yes, let's go on with this first comment. <coughs> oh yeah, by the way, this video is even more failed than Justin Bieber as talk show master, lol. If you think that Kubo is a bad writer for getting inspired by some manga, then all shonen animes are a rip-off Dragon Ball Z. No, seriously, this was too wrong. Then, though, I just faux punned. What the fuck is a faux pun? Are you're just trolling? Okay, this comment. Let me, where, where, where can I begin? First off, the grammar is hideous. It's atrocious. Second off... I have no idea what the hell he's going on about. Now, he's pretty much talking about uh, Bleach having some stuff in it that could be a ripoff from certain anime series. And I would say, yeah, there are a lot of anime that have some, you know, things in them, some aspects that could be considered a ripoff from other series. But Bleach has done some stuff recently that you could say is almost close to plagiarism. But, I'm not going to get deep into that. And now he's just saying something about this person trolling. And, uh, I could barely understand this. It's, it's just laughable. You gotta laugh at the ridiculous grammar in these comments. I swear, I don't know what the internet is coming to when people cannot even spell words correctly. Or at least use commas or periods or any of that shit. But... On to the next comment. Now, this comment is pretty much a total mindfuck because you can barely understand what the person is trying to say. Here, I'll try to make this, you know, as clear as possible. So, here we go. Another questions. <laughs> he said questions. Does Ichigo loves her mother? No. If that were true, you can say, yeah, this series is all about fight, adventure, yeah. Like a fucking child. But it's not. The series talk about Mary's Byakuyan. Mary's with Hisana, etc. Mar Mary's is. Is he trying to say Mary? Because you don't say Mary's. That's not proper grammar. So I know you just say the people should stop making comments like Ichiruki forever, etc. Yeah. You're nobody to say them to stop. Just shut the fuck up and let everybody think what they want to. And if girls see this, it's because they like, why aren't they seeing novels or something? Okay, I could barely read a fucking paragraph. 
I don't know if this person, you know, if English is a second language to this person or not, but the grammar is horrible, it's all over the place. I could barely make out what he's trying to say. So pretty much he's trying to say something about the whole Ichiruki debate, which has been going on recently. And and pretty much he's saying everybody should just think what they want to think. Well, yeah, anybody can think what they want to think. It, that doesn't mean what they think is correct or the right way of thinking. But yeah, this is a pretty much example of horrible bleached fanboy. Now, on to the next comment. You're a whiny little bitch. Well, that was short and to the point. But yeah. See, reading these comments, I'm starting to think. Are the bleached fanboys worse than the Naruto fanboys or the One Piece fanboys? Because these comments are pretty horrendous. Okay. Next comment. I like this fucking arc, and I'm a true freaking fan. You are just a trolling ass fucker. Oh, where can I begin? One, he misspelled trolling. T R O L L O I N G. Nice. Also, he called this person an ass fucker. Now, you could you could disagree and say you like a certain arc. But there's no reason to go out of your way to call a certain person ass fucker. Because it, cause it makes you look like a douchebag. And if you like an arc, then just say you like the arc. And that you're a true fan. But you don't have to go all the way to say someone's an ass fucker. I'm starting to believe that most of these fanboys have the IQ of a goldfish. But that can be said about most fanboys, but... I want to say Bleach fanboys are the worst fanboys out of all anime fanboys, but they are pretty bad from what I'm seeing from these comments. And last but not least, this one. What the fuck is your problem, you bitch-ass motherfucker? I don't see you writing amazing shit. All you're doing is being a fucking hater. And stop saying Shinigami, 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 you dumb fuck. Oh man, this is just amusing. This pretty much sums up the entire Bleach fan base in this one paragraph. <laughs> See, you gotta love the internet where people are able to post anything they want to and post their opinions. And also shows you, you know, how intelligent they are. Because this is just plain out laughable. <laughs> it's ridiculous the lengths some fanboys will go to to, make th to get their point across. And I'm not saying it's successful. Because it's obviously not successful. If you pull something like this on me, it's not going to be successful in trying to get your point across. And the term fucking hater has been done so many fucking times. It's, 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 that one word has been oversaturated. Seriously, if someone dislikes something, they're just called a hater. That's what they all call it. You're a fucking hater, man. Fuck you, man. You're a fucking hater. I, I have to say, I was amused by these comments I found. They were, they're just completely amusing. I'm almost tempted to show you what this person's name is, but nah, I'm gonna keep it anonymous because, you know, that's the way this is, this segment is going to operate. Nah, I just want to make things clear. I don't hate Bleach. I just don't like these ignorant fanboys who try and act like they're 10 years old on the fucking internet. And with that, I end this first episode of Silly Mind Numbing YouTube Comments. So please, tell me your thoughts about these comments. And let me know if they opened your mind a bit to the world of fanboys. Now, I plan on doing more videos like this. They're not going to be weekly. They're not going to be monthly. They're going to be whenever I feel like it, every so often. So, whenever I'm browsing YouTube and I come across... A ridiculous silly comment which I know I will cuz this is after all YouTube I will probably use it in one of these videos so yes I hope you guys had a good laugh at those hilarious comments and I will see you guys later so keep on keeping on peace